What do you remember about meeting Wayne Ferris for the first time, the Honky Tonk Man? Well, he was in Calgary a long time after I left. And he, Memphis, wherever he worked at, I mainly he was just in Canada. And they saw him up there and they, they brought him in. And he was originally going to be a baby face and then they turned him. He did, he did a good job. He did a good job with that. So you guys got along backstage and everything before you teamed up too? Cause you yeah, because he, yeah, he was always friendly. We've always been friends. We kid each other and stuff, but uh, when they put us together and <laughs> it took a while to talk me into doing it, but I, you know, I went for it. You know, what I enjoyed mainly about it was because, you know, I was always smash mouth, in your face type wrestler, no bullshit, work holds, not a bunch of crazy ass bumps, everything realistic, hard chops, hard punches, everything. So this was a, a departure for me when I got into the rhythm and blues thing. And it was fun acting like I could sing and play a guitar and and I've always been a big rock and roll fan anyway. And so this, and a big Elvis fan. And so I, they didn't tell me to do all this extra stuff, but I did it. Got me a couple of jackets and uh, I just went with it, enjoyed it. They cut us off way too early. Um, and the reason they cut us off, it probably everybody, because Vince signed the Road Warriors, always wanted them. And he got a chance to get him, and so he split us up. You know, I was still there, but I went to Japan all the time, and they brought me back. But Honky, <laughs> they took Honky and, and gave him a job of announcing because the guy could talk really good, and he was going to be with Vince. And that didn't work out, so Honky was gone. But we hooked up on the independent stuff, and I got my blonde hair back. And But, you know, that, that part of my... I, I I look back at it and it was fun. And they were supposed they were supposed to do a good deal with us and let us have the belts. We're gonna take them off the hearts, but like I said, business is business and Vince got the road warriors, so he moved us around, you know. Yeah, because you had that big match at WrestleMania five at Atlantic City, you and Honky against the Yeah, exactly. I forgot about that one. Yeah. Yeah, so we were we were on our way. I still have my blonde hair then. You know, Jesse Ventura is the one. He was announcing with Vince, and I was in Phoenix, and I came out or someplace, and it was Rhythm and Blues. We already thought up her name, but I still had the blonde hair and the robes. And, and Jesse says, Vince, just think of the shock value of it, having Valentine coming out with black hair. Ding, Vince, you know, his brain went, that's a hell of an idea. So Jimmy Hart was with us then. He was always with me. And he kept saying, they want to do that. They want to do So I made him wait. I wasn't sure I was going to do it because we were rhythm and blues anyway. I still had the blonde hair. He, he actually, Jimmy Hart would carry the black dye around with him and show it to me. You could do it right here, Hammer. Hey, baby, we could do it right here, baby. Hammer, really, they really want to do this. It's really going to be good. He bugged me all over the place. And uh, finally in Phoenix, Arizona, we were doing a TV taping. He talked me into it. So dyed my hair black. He did it. And I went out that night with black hair. <laughs> A funny story, after I got back home, I'm I'm at the Tampa airport, and it's a circular thing where they pick you up and, and your wives would pick you up or whoever. And Julie went by twice, didn't recognize me because of the black hair. <laughs> oh, my good. She wasn't too happy with that. But the black hair, you know, I'd set out on the beach and, uh, and the dye would drip all over me. And I had a... Corvette convertible back then, so it wasn't the same. It wasn't a blonde hair blowing in the breeze. It was black hair blowing in the breeze and dye flying off. <laughs> so I wasn't too happy with that part, but uh, it was fun. And I stayed another year. 
And the money was good. The hair uh, came back blonde. It did, yeah. You got it back. 